the girls are in the waiting room. That, that sounded like a production to me. I always feel a little awkward, like I'm disturbing this precious moment. Yeah, they're like, are you okay? You cool? You cool? <laughs> hey Daphne, put two in your butt. Oh, this one came down when we won. So, is it a boy or a girl? Alright, give them some time. I'm not going to stick my hand up our ass to find out if there's eggs in there. I think that's kind of uncool. So yesterday I planted some more stuff. Uh, I figured that we've already planted a bunch of seeds last week. And that gave a little time. There's a little bit of sun to kind of bring those up as the fall approaches. Plus lines! Woohoo! Public transportation's awesome. Um, these are some different things that we planted. I have to ask Deborah again because she's one that threw the seeds in here. I know some of it's Swiss chard. Um, I think some of it's rutabaga. But I'm not 100% sure which one's which. And I know spinach is in there too. But I went ahead and got some lettuces. Like a fancy mixed green. Um, it's called, what is it called? Yoshitami Brothers lettuce. Gourmet blend. So that'll be good for salads and, um, you know, for good lettuce or veggie burgers and, and uh, tuna sandwiches and things. That'll be nice. Um, and then you got your run-of-the-mill romaine lettuce. I figure this is good for everything. You make a Caesar salad, you can put it on um, sandwiches. Um, just a good hearty lettuce. So that'll be really nice to have. It's great to be able to pull things like that out. So I thought I'd give the update. Of course, I had sunflower. But I'm looking forward to the fall. I was a little bit bummed because I was thinking that we were cheating a little bit of summer. It didn't really start until the very beginning of July, actually. And, uh, well, it was nice, though, while it lasted. And we only had, like, one night where it got hot enough to where I was uncomfortable in bed. We never had to pull the air conditioning out of the basement to put in our bedroom to sleep at night. Except for that one night, I felt like it would have been nice. And... I don't think it ever really got over 95. That was the only time. That one day. So uh, I can't really complain. It's And fall, I love the smells. We were walking around. and I was reminded, reminded of Halloween coming up. And uh, the smell of firewood. As people are starting to warm up. Although I thought that was a little bizarre. Because it's not exactly cold yet. It's not a time to put your furnace on. But still, there's something special about that. And wearing sweaters. And when the leaves start falling... So it'll be nice. But if it starts raining this weekend, I think that's going to mean start pulling all these puppies off here. Red or green. And that goes for every tomato plant that I have before the frost hits. So that's when it just kills them off. So let's go check on the chickens again. See if she's moved out of the way. I'm assuming not because she was pretty occupied. Dottie, are you eating the basil? took some basil flowers off the plant so that would grow and apparently she really likes that okay all right Hi, Petunia. Mm, she's not ready yet still still pushing breathe don't forget to breathe all right she works out her contractions. I'm going to go have coffee. I'm desperately in need of coffee. Another night of dry mouth and not as bad as the last two nights. For some reason, I must be coming down with something because I feel bumps around my tongue and dry mouth and I hadn't been able to sleep for two nights because I was just needing water constantly and it never was enough. The last night it was about half the night where I had a little bit of that as soon as I had some water, I was good for like a good couple hours. It wasn't nearly as bad as the first two nights. Anyways, I'm looking forward to the cause and effect interview tonight and do my radio show and find out what's up with those guys and the concert coming up here in Portland, in San Francisco. And I hope everybody is having a good day. Take care.